Grow the dragon! Yes! How to train your dragon! The fuck is that thing? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Castle Woodwarf 2. I am Dynamite, and today I'll be protecting a dwarven castle along with a dragon egg. I don't actually think that dragons and dwarves g get along too well, but apparently in this game they do. And also look at this bastard, his hairy chest, his magnificent beard, and his really small axe. I mean, what the fuck is this thing, dude? Come on! Now, if you have never heard about this game, basically, it's a little tiny game. Uh, the concept is simple. Get the resources, make troops, protect the, uh, protect the egg or protect the castle. So it's like tower defense basically with a bit of a resource management. A really small game, but... If you are actually looking for something just to click around because let's say you like waiting in the loading screen in a different game then i'm guessing you're gonna have a bit of a fun with this one uh there's like a s simple upgrade system over here so you get stars you buy upgrades over here for killing monsters you get like rubies or whatever that thing is and then you can buy different stuff over here so allow me to show you the actual game so first we're gonna select the difficulty i feel like a true adventurer like a true dwarf so of course we're gonna try to go on the hard difficulty and see how this thing is gonna go so uh you're gonna be facing green slimes your usual blob right sounds easy enough let's do this hell yeah buy a gatherer gatherers pick up valuable resources okay Buy another one. No. <laughs> okay, whatever. I know. Dwarves love to eat. Hey, really? Okay. Dwarves love to eat. Keep up with the food. All right. Buy a hammer dwarf. Hey, maybe his name is Larry, not a hammer dwarf. What if his name is Larry, or Bob, or well, if that's actually Kevin, you can go fuck yourself. Food storage is on the top of the screen. You've noticed it. And apparently, my dwarves are only capable of eating carrots. Well. You know, since in the mines it's really bloody as dark, I'm guessing the carrots are actually good for your eyes. And after buying another dwarf, we can call the enemy earlier. So, this is like, you know, you go outside of your castle, you grab this gigantic tube, whatever thing, and you just yell, DINNER! And those idiots just go around- what the heck is this thing? <laughs> can we just seal up the, the entrance, you know, and be completely fine with this thing? No, no, apparently. We actually need to defend ourselves, so let's call more enemies, get ourselves some more gatherers, and of course, get ourselves some more warriors. More warriors. Yes, summon more blobs, boys. <laughs> summon the name. <laughs> Allow the blobs to come forward. I got a lot of hammers for their faces. Also, why only one of my dwarves is actually fighting? Why not all of you are fighting? That is ridiculous. Challenge unlocked. I've managed to beat level one. How hard was it? How dare you? Game? I thought you're actually gonna throw a challenge at me, but no! So probably like wondering what the heck you can do with all of those resources. Well, as I said, you can spend them in the shop. And this time you won't be actually buying yourself loot boxes. Nope. Instead, you'll be buying yourself trees. And then after finishing a mission, you're gonna get stars. So you can invest those stars into something more formidable. So for example, you can increase the amount of dwarves that you're gonna have. Uh, veggies and trees grow more often. Start the game with a baby dragon. I saw an egg, so I'm guessing how that thing is gonna go. Uh, brute force, stronger warriors, or gatherers can carry two items. Okay, so this thing is gonna cost me two stars, this one is gonna cost me one star. So let's get those two things. Let's get two those those two things and actually try to advance in mission two. Ooh, a red slime. Blobblier than usual. Oh no. He just have a bit more hit points, boy, and that's actually it. Well, we're gonna see about that thing. The blob infestation is larger than we expected. We will need some crossbows. Uh, how about some dynamite and a catapult? Buy a lumber dwarf. What is his, what if his name is, I don't know, Richard? Huh? How about that game? Have you thought about the feelings of your own dwarfs? I guess not. Magic trees bring the best income. I've heard about magic mushrooms, but magic trees? Interesting. Grow the dragon. Yes. How to train your dragon. The fuck is that thing? Dude, you look like an oversized frog, not an actual dragon. Use arrows to move. Oh, great! <laughs> he understands basic commands. Lovely. New unit. What's this thing? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I want to check what is this thing. Can't touch this. Oh, yeah. That's the crossbow buy. Okay. Smashing. Right. But I think we need to get some tanks actually in the front. So let's get two warriors. Two magnificent warriors. And I'm gonna try to get myself some more crossbowmen. 
Yeah, why the fuck I even need to bother with the crossbow man? My warders are more than enough to deal with this pathetic infestation. Ha! This guy is really loving his job, man. That lumbi lumberjack. <laughs> He's fucking fabulous! <laughs> what the actual shit is that guy? Okay, uh, my dwarves are getting pushed back, so can I use my dragon? Go, my dragon, go! Uh, so how do I attack? Okay, do you have fire? Maybe you have fire. Wait, uh, space bar. No, you don't have a you don't have a fire attack. Okay, <laughs> fall back, fall back, dragon. <laughs> That's not good. Wait, I can upgrade him. Should I try to upgrade him? Probably no. Oh no, I'm losing food. No, I lost food. I lost all of my food. No, this is terrible. And yet somehow I've managed to win. How? No idea. So now I can actually get myself some more upgrades. Vigis and trees grow more often. Yeah, that sounds like a, something good to use. Um, build a fountain that brings gold. Ooh! Gold! And what's with level 3? Fresh fish. Maybe we should try fishing after delivering those underground threats. Uh, that's a brown rat. Fucking scavens, man. Buy a fisher dwarf. Bait ready. Okay, at least this guy is not running around fabulously. <laughs> He's just running around normally. Right, let's get some gatherers, call in the enemy. What's this? Sweet, I got a... F fucking Gandalf is joining the party. Have some! Right. Hopefully that thing will be more than enough to deal with this threat. <laughs> Go, my warriors! Go! Deal with the blobs! <laughs> oh no, that's a brown rat. You look like a little horse, what the shit. I've bought so many warriors, I can now actually upgrade the dragon. Yeah, alright, so I'm gonna get some more gold and hopefully this walking frog will be a bit more dangerous than I think it is. I mean, you're supposed to do something, right? Anything. You should be capable of doing something at least. Okay, get another tank over here. Right, attack my- oh shit, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> okay, note to self, do not send the dragon forward. Can you finally do something? If you get healing, that's actually it. Not a big fan of the dragon, you know? This is not how you're supposed to train your own dragon. And also, we're gonna die in a very few seconds. Uh, can somebody call in more warriors, please? I really, really need some warriors. Attack the blob! Never mind, we won. What I can say, I'm natural at this game. Chipper army, monk's healing range is doubled. Ooh, that sounds actually nice. And let's get more dwarves now. Right, mission four, Miran Dream. Ah! Goblins. It's just a goblin. What do you expect? Well, I don't know. A deeper sentence? A deeper meaning? Anything? Oh no! It seems that the goblins are responsible for the blob infestation. I don't want to know how. Oh great, now I got a new hat over there. Grow more veggies. Uh, no. Okay, grow more trees. Okay. I know. I know. Right, I want to buy myself a fisherer and I want to buy myself the woodcutter. <laughs> There he is, fabulously running to the trees. <laughs> oh no, okay. Let's call in the enemy, get ourselves the caster, and I need to summon the warriors very soon. Summon the warriors. Call in the fane. The enemies are at our gates. We need to defend. The dragon egg, why? I have no idea, just defend it. I don't think that the dwarves understand the basic concept of running next to healer, I mean. And probably the healers do not understand the basic concept of covering the tanks. I mean, no wonder those idiots require my assistance. You're doing everything wrong! Like, how you've managed to survive this long is just beyond me right now. More warriors. Call in the warriors. Every single one of them. So, why do I need the dragon again? Can somebody explain this to me? Because, you know, I'm dealing with this thing. Quite capable on my own, without the dragon. Sorry, with the oversized frog. I've actually wondered, can I level up the dragon a bit more? Like, he's actually like, capable of doing something. Attack! <laughs> yeah, if I'm gonna put him richly behind the tanks... Yeah, he can help out! I see him moving. Great! A dream dragon! Hey, he is now actually doing some type of damage. Lovely! Okay, back off. Do some healing. See, idiots? That's how you're supposed to work with your healers. I mean, you guys are so pathetic, it's just unbelievable. And now I lost my food. Um, okay, either we're gonna kill the enemy really quick or I'm gonna die out. 
Um, can, can somebody car. get some food? Yo, we are dying. Hello. Uh oh. Hmm. I've lost my food. <laughs> Out of food, get better fish. <laughs> Fuck you, game. Eggplant. It's not what you think. What the hell I was supposed to think? <laughs> red fish. It's red color. Make it so sophisticated. I see myself out. <laughs> right, that. Oh, oh. I don't have enough money to actually buy all this thing. Well, shit. I'm just gonna ignore the fact that every single dwarf has exactly the same voice. You know? It's a different son from a different mother, I guess. I'm not gonna ask questions. I mean, the king was busy after all. I just don't want to know who spawned this beauty, the oversized frog, because that's gonna be like a mystery. <laughs> and I'm. Grinding out of food again. Yo, can you fish those things a bit faster, please? That'd be really wonderful. You're not fishing the thing things fast enough, you know? Seriously, the second time in a row, what kills me is not the enemy. It's actually the lack of food. Oh, look, more enemies spawning. Yay! <laughs> I'm so bad at this game. I'm so incredibly bad. Well, I still survived. Uh-oh. Losing food again. Come on, guys! Kill them a bit faster! <laughs> it's either the enemy or us! Deal with them quickly! Okay, you're gathering the food. Right, we should be fine. Holy shit, I survived! <laughs> One star. Hey, go fuck yourself! Explore the lost secrets of the lake! Yeah, that sounds really awesome. I prefer to get that thing than this stupid ass dragon. Oh no! <laughs> Blue goblins! I should have probably like upgraded the hat of the dwarves either way as well. Right, fisherer, gatherer, lumberjack, fisherer, uh, gatherer. Get the goblins in. And summon the army! Hmm, I think I need a bit more cash. There we go, thank you. Right, one dwarf should be capable of stopping them from the time being at least. And I'm gonna get a bunch of resources on, on this surface, I hope. Get a gatherer as well. Right, now I just have to spam the units. So the warrior, the healer. Warrior, the healer. Warrior, the healer. If you're gonna try to summon the healer. I didn't hear a jack shit what you said. But okay, fine. Adaba kadaba, man. Adaba kadaba. That's dwarfish for magic, if you didn't know. Right. Oh, summon more. <laughs> like I said. Oh no, the blue goblins are attacking me. No, what I'm gonna do? Oh no! Blue goblins are attacking me! They're actually really dangerous, what the fuck? Yo, guys! The shit! Can you actually, like, try to defend? That'd be lovely! Okay, I'll need to get a crossbow boy over here. Because this is getting out of hand. This is getting really out of hand. You're serious about this? If you just, like, spam the slingers, then I'll be so fucked. <laughs> this is ridiculous! <laughs> What? I've lost to a pack of blue goblin boys? What? You gotta be kidding me right now with this man. Oh no, more blue goblins. Summon more warriors quickly! Master. Well, at least now I'm using the benefits of a healer. Never mind, he's dead. The egg just got annihilated by those guys. <laughs> hey, the egg can actually tank it. What the heck? Oh no, it can't. I'm losing hearts. Yay! That's gonna be nice. Defeat. Really? You failed to protect the dragon. Oh no, what are we gonna do now? Let's try this thing one more time. This time I got myself like a better castle. And I got myself a crate. It's supposed to stop the enemies from like a little tiny bit. Right. Uh, fisherer, cut, woodcutter, gatherer. Down below, warrior, archer. This time I'm gonna rely on archers, you know? A bit more. <laughs> because I don't think that the medic, medic is capable of defending me that well. So yeah. You're getting fired, Mr. Medic Boy! Uh, okay, it's progressing so far so good. Right, just give me more cash so I'll be able actually to, you know, summon more archers. I mean, I kinda like need those guys, so if you could be so kind. And also, why does the warrior charge us forward so much? I understand the Dwarven Fury and, you know, Will of Battle, but this is just ridiculous at the moment. He's not on a suicidal mission, but I think this guy actually wants to, like, game end himself. Let's be honest over here. There's no normal reason why in the God's name you would charge like that at the enemy. Honestly, there is none. At least none of them I can think of. And yet most gatherers on the top. Because why the heck no? Right. See? My arrows are actually more devastating than your arrows. What you gonna do now? 
<laughs> Too bad that the soldier spawns so slowly. Oh my god. Can you spawn even slower? Come on, boys. You really need to start spawning a bit faster. It's not it's not helping. <laughs> but the rain of arrows is helping, boy! <laughs> the rain of arrows. Alright, let's try to upgrade that dragon. I don't know why I'm still upgrading that bitch. It's completely useless. <laughs> He's not gonna survive five seconds over there. He's the most useless dragon in the entire dragon family. Why do we even protect him? Because one day he's gonna be big and strong. Yeah, when? I don't know. Well, nobody knows. But eventually the name is gonna run out of troops to spawn, so that's exactly what I'm trying to do over here. Also, seal this passage. I've noticed that you're building the castles with the exactly same flav. You're making yourself a two oversized basement. And some homeless hobos got inside. That explains the fucking dwarves. I mean goblins. So ladies and gentlemen, this has been Castle Woodwarf. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. As I said, like a little tiny game uh, for you to enjoy a little bit. Like if you're looking for like a clicker game, you're looking for some tower defense game. So yeah, this is the second game. Uh, the first game, if I remember correctly, looks very similar to this one. So if you can enjoy it and you want to support the developer, feel free to get both the games. I mean, they are like dirt cheap on Steam anyway. So yeah. Don't expect much though. This is not gonna be the next StarCraft. This is not gonna be the next, I don't know, there are billions of stuff like that. No, 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 that's completely not gonna be the thing. But, as I said, if you're just looking for like a clicker game and you have a few bucks to spare, then I'm guessing this game is gonna be actually like for you. I'm not gonna be recording more of this because uh, like this is exactly the same thing over and over and over and over again, so I think it's like a bit pointless to, to record more episodes of this game, but I don't know, we're gonna see, maybe in the future. For now though, ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna leave this thing as a video, so thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed, if you liked the episode, please do a lot, I'll see you all in the next video.